Hi! Today's video we're going to show you how to put a camera skin onto a uh, disposable camera. Now if you've looked around on the internet or just about anywhere you've seen those cute little wedding cameras and they're the disposable cameras and they have the pretty little covers on them and they run about three dollars and ninety nine cents four dollars most places it's six and up for one disposable camera so what we're going to show you is how you can take a Fujifilm quick snap just a regular disposable camera that runs about 349 379 if you buy them in a two pack so you're getting two um, in a pack and take it and turn it into a wedding camera so this way you're spending half the amount of money for uh, a disposable camera so that's a really nice uh, savings of money there for you okay and uh, as you can see on this web page I can't take the credit for this uh, project that was from another website but I thought I would just add a little bit to it and show you actually how to do it so you've uh, probably gotten all your craft supplies we're going to take the cardboard cover off of this camera and uh, you have your template done and cut out and ready the easiest way to do this um, I actually use double stick tape instead of glue because it works just as well it's permanent it sticks you don't have to wait for it to dry it doesn't ooze out or get all over it's not messy and then I use regular tape just to hold things in place until I get to the double stick tape part so what we're going to do first is take the template and we're going to fold on the creases so this way everything is folded where it needs to be folded ahead of time it makes it a lot easier to work with so we're going to take these and fold these on the little scores fold your tabs so just kind of pre-folding pre-fold the tabs on the ends this is a fun project especially because you save a lot of money not only that but you can customize your covers so instead of getting the generic wedding memories with the silver bells and the gold rings or the nice little roses if your wedding theme is purple you can make a purple cover if you're having kayla lilies you can make a kayla lily cover all you need to have is Microsoft Publisher or Adobe Photoshop or another kind of an editing pro um, photo editing program and you can make your own cover template to print out and then you can print out as many as you need to but what a savings if you're saving three dollars and fifty cents per camera okay so what we're going to do we have the template printed out pre-folded and the front of the camera so you're going to lay the template onto the camera then you're going to pick it up holding on to the top and bottom part so you'll flip it to the side here so you can see the ends where the tabs are and what you're going to do is taking the regular tape you're going to put the get the tabs situated so they're in the right spot okay so the tabs or your side tabs are what are going to get folded first so you're going to tape them into place this way they don't move around on you while you're working with the camera this is where it's nice to have a uh, tape dispenser that stays in place so you, you can do it with one hand unfortunately my permanent desktop tape dispenser is empty right now so we're using that one okay so we've got those tabs done now this is where the double stick tape comes in so you want to use a piece of double tick double stick tape on the tab part that's going to get folded over and you'll put a little more tape right here on the ends of your tabs and then you'll just fold it in apply some pressure this way it sticks 
And this is where the double stick tape is really handy. You don't have to hold it and wait for it to dry. You push it down, press around on it, and it sticks. Okay, now we'll do the same thing with the other side. Put it on top of the tabs that you just taped in place. Put it on the other tab. And on this one, you can put a little bit on the side right here. Just a little bit on the side here. And then you'll fold this one in. And press down on that tab. Give it a little extra pressure. And it sticks. So now all you have left is the part that folds up and the part that folds down. Okay. And this will all use double stick tape on it. So putting it on the bottom part first, since this is what's going to get folded up first. Okay. Fold that up, push it in place, and that'll stay there. That double stick tape is very strong, believe me. I use double stick tape to do my own uh, wedding invitation envelopes. And nothing came apart in the mail. I use double stick tape in place of glue for a lot of things, actually. I just, I prefer it because it's not messy. Okay. And then all you do is fold it down. Give it some pressure. And you might have a little bit of trimming to do once you have it all on the camera. Okay, and now you have a wedding camera that you spent half the price buying at retail. It's custom, it's how you want it to be, and they're cute. Okay, and that's it for this video. Thanks.